it to go, what, two hours? Two hours? Yeah. About two and a half hours down to San Diego because we're going to SeaWorld. So I will see you guys when I get down there. And I hope you love the video once it's done. Alright. Bye. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Where are we at? Are we at SeaWorld? Good job. <laughs> you gonna have fun? Yeah. You gonna touch animals? Yes. Yeah? You gonna I'm see all the rides. animals? I'm riding You gonna ride the rides? Yeah. Cool. I'll catch up to you after okay. sharks, okay? He's gonna catch up to us when we get to the sharks. So, we will see you guys momentarily. I'm trying to get a cart rented. So, yeah. Here's the carts. I'm trying to rent them. Alright. He's liking the crabs. We're, we're gonna go next right there. We're gonna go see the sharks first. Um, I got my little cart. I got a cart so that way I don't have to do too much walking. And what did you think? It was cool. You touched. He touched a horseshoe crab, by the way. Look, there she goes. Nay's touching a crab now. Is there some in there? Okay, well, get your hand out of there. Are you touching the sharks? Yeah. Oh my god, the fin feels so funny. Why are they laying down right here? I don't know. This one keeps swimming. Sharks. I'm gonna I'm gonna attempt. They feel slimy. Ew. What is it? Oh, his little fin. His fin right here is like broken. He's bleeding. They feel weird, huh? He does. Two fingers, Ray. Two fingers like this. Wow, they feel funny. Yeah, they're sleeping. Don't touch its gills on his back. Okay, let's try this again. I tried to record, but it didn't record. So, anyways. Well, there's people coming.
He's conceited. He wants lots of pictures. <laughs> I'm not taking a picture. I'm taking video. What? <laughs> Come on. Come on. Drag it down. Get down from there. Hey. Little man's recording now. What's up? It's oh, me look, and my dad. Helicopter. Hey, look, people, it's a helicopter up there, even though you can't see it. <laughs> well, it's my dad here. Okay, that's my eyeball. There's Renee. Hello. And I hope you like the video. Bye. <laughs> There's a whole bunch of people in the way. Oh, he's blowing bubbles. Dre, go over there and take video. Go over there and take video. Hurry. And then there's the other one over there. I think that one's a female. The big, the huge one is the cat. There's love again. Oh, I'm in the shade. <laughs> it was totally cheesy. Did you get the smiling part? Yeah, it was totally cheesy. Yay! Cheesing. It was the uh, yeah, I think it was oh, okay. Oh, this video is going to be so much fun to edit. <laughs> it Dan, was, it's still it going. Was, yeah, I know. It was the male. It oh. was the male that was cheesing. Oh. Stop it. You can if you want to. Still going. They see me rolling. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, read it again. What does it say? It says his name is... Kaiga. I Ikea yeah. and it's a male and it was born August 25th 2002 it weighs 7,200 pounds and 19 feet 7,219 pounds his tail is five feet eight inches that is okay, crazy I'm gonna pause it. no that is crazy and the female oh female Oop. The, it's slipping and the female is born February 25th, 1993, and it weighed 5,000 pounds, and it's 20 feet. 5,000 pounds and 20 feet. And high-flying... High-flying athletic orca was unique oh, it's vocalization. Oh, it's blowing! It blowed! Oh, it's blowing bubble. It's blowing from its flute. Huh. No, it was up and it blowed. Yeah, I know. It literally go... The water literally spurts out forward and then the top plays out like that and people usually get wet. All right, we're here gonna watch the, what is it called? The Orca, or show? Or orca show, the Killer Whales. Waiting for it to start, they're loading people up in the, in the stadium. I wish I was closer, but then again, I don't wanna get super, super soaked. So, it's a good thing that we're over here. Up above the the soak zone is just like what? It's, it's three over. down. It's three down. It still says it right there. I know. It says three down. Oh yeah. See one, one. Wait, no. It's I don't know. One, two, three, four. I can't count today apparently, but it's four down from here. When do you think they're gonna start? One o'clock, huh? One o'clock. Okay. Well, they're gonna start the show at one o'clock. So, I mean, they're swimming, the orchids are swimming around already. They let them out already. So, last time we came to SeaWorld, we missed the show. So, we got the, what, the very butt end of it, huh? Yeah. So, we got the very butt end of the show. Oh my gosh, it is hot out here. I got some water. I need some water. I do too. Oh, 
I don't like putting my mouth on cans or bottles or anything, so yeah. I spill water all over myself. Give Dre some, please. I don't need one. You don't want one? If I do, I'm just gonna leave back. Sure. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Are you still recording? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm just recording. Just to record. I'll edit it. <laughs> Okay, let's see. I'm going to point you guys towards the water for a little while. I know. What time is it? I don't know. 12 what? 12.41. Okay. It is 12.41 and the show starts at 1 o'clock. So, yeah. A lot more people are coming, but I'm glad we got to come and see the show. Because last time we didn't get to see, see, the, see the show. So, I'm kind of excited. I mean, it's kind of sad that they have these animals kind of locked up. I know that it, 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 it does that. Okay. Well, let me make sure what's the what's name, though. Make sure Oh, there's a big one. Look. There's what four in there? One, two, okay. three, four. I don't know how many. There's two over there. There's one, two, three, four. Yeah, I know. One, two, three. I don't know. The dark. The water's kind of a little bit dark. Huh? Yeah. The the twenty. The what? Dre, you don't even sit down. No, I want you to sit. Hey, look. Look, they have your squib hats. <laughs> they have your squib hats. Why are you killing my friend? <laughs> Sorry, fingers in the way. Almost. Look at all these people. There's all these people. And they're still loading more and more and more. There's a lot of people here today. What? So the 28th. Yep. 28th of what? We get, yep. We get Lexi. We get Lexi and then oh. we come back. Look, there's Dre Squib hat. Okay. Look. Stop killing my face. Dre Squib hat is better. I want a squid. Get your squid hat. You have a red one. No. No. Yes. Yeah. You have cash on you? Ten row. You are sitting in the wet zone. Please be aware that the splashing salt water can damage cameras. No. That's right there. Thank you. Not in it'll damage cameras and video equipment, but we have a waterproof camera. So oh. it won't damage ours. <laughs> well it's still gonna wet us if it wet's dumb. No. There it's gonna wet up the there. There. Up to right there. Oh, a nice Ten. breeze. I just counted. Nice what? breeze, huh? Yeah. Did you feel the breeze? Yeah. Uh, then I just counted one, two, three, four, five, six, oh. seven, eight, nine. Damn, they're nine, so we're ten. No, they're not, Dre. The, the, look, go on the, in the aisle and the black line right there, it'll say the soap zone. You see it? Orca encounter. What is this? Thank you. Uh, hold this, please. It's recording. The world has one interconnected ocean. A vast blue expanse, critical to life on Earth. And there's no better animal to represent the story of the ocean with all its splendor oh, and uncertainty Thank you. than the killer whale. Thank or you. as it's scientifically known, Bye, baby the Orcinus orca. Well, got me a hat because the sun is too The orca hot. lives oh, in face. every corner of the ocean. Okay, from the be starting. to the Atlantic, the Southern, to the Sweaty. Indian, to the mighty Pacific, and beyond.
This whale story oh, is the ocean story, oh, and it is one we all share. They're telling a story. Right. Listen, because they're telling a story. They're going to start in a few minutes. We are so honored to introduce you to this intriguing oh, there we go. and majestic animal. Sorry you guys can't see, it's too small. My camera doesn't zoom. All the whales are... I know, they're like, I did a trick, give me my fish. <laughs> In fact, kind of like Ellie. Least <laughs> yep. <laughs> killer whales. I wonder why some of them, their their fins. I don't really remember why. The 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 size. Size. A reason why, I forgot. Physical form. I think it's female or something. Social I think structure it. and habitat. Look, it's once more. I know, he's all feed me. The differences that are subtle, but noticeable good. when compared side by side. Orcas are adapted perfectly to their environments. And even the whale's black and white coloration has a purpose. It camouflages the outline of their bodies in the water, making it easier for them to surprise and catch their prey. This one, it's upside down. <laughs> that whale's upside down. Ray, he's upside down. He's upside down. When viewed from below, I know. Because white bellies match the brighter surface of the water, blending with the light above, giving them the perfect camouflage. Look. 
There they go. <laughs> Look at there, like, give me some more fish and I'll do more tricks. Killer whales are highly social Just animals. Like Ellie, I'm telling with you. With a well defined social yeah. structure. An orca pod is always led by a female. Though just half the size of her male counterpart, she is in charge. It's all yeah. about attitude. Oh, I know. Because they live and work as oh, a group, got a good one. orcas need to communicate good with one. sounds and body language. Orcas use clicks for echolocation or navigation. Look at this shark. Dang, that, that whale looks huge. To socialize in the pod. I know those little itty bitty fish can't really satisfy Oh, they feed them more than that. This is just to, so they can perform. I don't know. They probably rather be in the ocean with their family. Vocal development studies here at SeaWorld show that early on, calves learn vocalization from their mothers. But as they grow, they learn from others close to them as well. This is a bottlenose dolphin call that Shuka learned and even taught other killer whales here at SeaWorld. In fact, Orcas are the largest members of the dolphin family. Oh, they're singing. You hear them, Jay? They're singing. They're singing. Whales here and in the wild use vocalization to communicate all the time. Like all animals, killer whales use body language to communicate. <laughs> Saying hi. A pectoral slap is used to show dominance and to get noticed. For example, a mother may use Dre, a slap you to like get it? her cat's attention. He's all into the show. And when orcas really want to be heard, they <laughs> look, there they go. Spy hopping is used to get a good look at their surroundings while they're hunting. <laughs> Did you see them? Right there. Slaps are another part of communication used by killer whales out in the wild. They're flapping their fins. <laughs> I think my godson is liking this. This is his first time here. <laughs> Orcas are good communicators, so it's no wonder they're at the top of the ocean's food chain. Uh huh. Oh, look at all the pigeons. <laughs> you want I hope the pigeons Killer don't whales crack on my work head. together to rear their young, protect their pod, they and most importantly, want. pursue the and fish. catch uh -huh. their prey. Every day they cooperate to survive See, in the wild oceans of the world. A lot of fish. The orca's hunting techniques are as varied as the whales mean. themselves. No, I don't know who that was. Norwegian oh, killer coming. whales will circle herring, herding them together. The whales use sounds to coordinate with each other and to disorient oh, the herring. Oh, he's spitting water. He's spitting his with water. The fish confused and contained, the whales stun them with their powerful tail flukes, making for an easy meal.
Watch oh, as okay. one of our wheels demonstrates the same behavior and movement right here in front of all of you. Trained him. Plays an important part of everyday what? life of our killer. The birds up there. It's how they teach the young to hunt and practice their skills as they grow. Orcas spend a lot of time interacting and showing their playful side out in the wild and here in Seabro. Porpoising is when killer whales swim fast, breaking at the surface of the water briefly. Sea World all the time. The whales are always mimicking 
and learning from one another. How long did it take, take them to train them though? I know, I was thinking the same thing. How did they get them to do all that? Like, what did they... Look at they're rolling. They're rolling around. Right. Pay attention to the show. Playful behavior has a purpose, and a tail whip is just one of the many behaviors killer whales use to stun prey out in the wild. But today, our orcas might just be stunning you. Getting wet. It must feel good. Got it was in our section. <laughs> that was all day that was every crazy. day to share in trusted relationships to provide optimal health care, research, and quality of life. How many so the whales huh? here take an active role so in their unfair. health and well being. They put the other one in the, Corky's in the back. Corky's going to demonstrate this right here with her behavior sample. Oh, yeah. Now this behavior is important because this is how our veterinarians collect a blood sample every month to monitor our whales overall health. Our whales we even slide up on a scale each week so we can monitor their growth rates huh? and ensure that they are provided the proper nutrition. We can even take a sample from their blowhole. All of these have behaviors are possible because of the strong bonds that we develop with these whales day after day here at SeaWorld. Ladies and gentlemen, in front of you is our oldest killer whale here at SeaWorld. Her name is Corky and she is 53 years old. Dang. Her. It was front. my first visit here at SeaWorld 53 over years four old. years ago where I saw Corky and fell in love and knew that I wanted to dedicate my life to protecting killer whales just like her out in the wild. She has a very sweet and docile personality and all of the behaviors are honored to work with her every day. We challenge the whales every day to learn new things, engage, and stimulate their minds. Diet, exercise, and play keep the whales in great shape. The whales here at SeaWorld have helped killer whales in the wild by participating in many research studies. One ongoing study monitors the whale's heart rate and breathing to understand how marine noise pollution from ship engines and other sources affect mm -hmm. wild populations. This is ready really as tough. In another that, study, Greg, scientists little. from NOAA, the National Oceanic and Atmospheric okay. Administration, mm -hmm. took measurements of the killer whales living here, including pregnant whales. By comparing these measurements with drone footage of killer whales in the wild, scientists are able to monitor the wild population's nutritional and reproductive states. Other research has been done here at SeaWorld on the mother whale's milk composition. This research will help create an effective model to understand how toxins in the ocean impact wild killer whales and their milk supply. <laughs> myself what up. we learn from the whales in our care every coming. day is actively helping whales in the wild survive. And just by being here today, you've supported our rescue, research, and conservation efforts all around the world. If we work together, like the killer whale, we can protect the future of your sinus orca and this beautiful planet that we all share. Okay, we're gonna leave.
<laughs> Thank you for joining us for Orchid Encounter. We hope you gain a great appreciation for All right. the incredible animals. Have a great rest of your day here. Uh, and we're on our way to Stingray. I love Stingray. They're my favorite. We'll get to the sharks. Don't worry about it. I already seen the sharks. We'll get to the sharks. You didn't see sharks. These are going to be big sharks. Wait, we can't touch the big Nope, you can't, but you can look. You better not, or you can drag. Too far under, huh? Yeah, it will wet my sleeve. I'm Look, gonna, here comes some more. I gotta lift up my sleeve. Here comes some more. I don't care if my sleeve gets wet. Uh, you'll be cooler. Look, okay. here comes another one. You can't reach it. There's another one. That was too far, Dan. I know. Yeah, it's too far. <laughs> Look at the baby one. Oh, that one's close. Oh, yeah. That's a, that's a shark, I think. No? Yeah? Look, there it goes. Look. Hey, I touched it. Even though my <laughs> Look. My sleeve got wet, but I touched it. Wow. <laughs> I touched this thing. Damn, my sleeve. Feel right. me, feel me. Yeah. Ow, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, it feels good. I'm gonna go back to me so she can come over here and look. Take this roller coaster. Is it coming this way? It's coming this way. It's coming this way. <laughs> there it goes. We and we're Nate getting on that one first. Okay, you and Nate can go on because I don't go roller coasters. Yay! If you guys want to go on, are you going to go on yeah. with him? Yeah. Okay, if he can ride it. We don't know if he can get on it. If, if you're tall enough. If, if you If you're tall enough, then you can go in there. Okay? So and I wait. So it's going to take us four hours to get one more going. Brave attempt. Little man Ready? is getting on the roller coaster yeah. with my girlfriend. Yeah. I don't go on roller coaster. So. I hope you like it. Bye. <laughs> I'm not going to be able to see them on this ride, but I'll try. I think it's just I'm going to film a roller coaster going up. <laughs> the roller coaster. I don't know. It goes so fast I can't even catch them. So they were out there. We'll wait till they get off. And then we're gonna go see I have no idea where's the map. I don't know where the map is. The map is 
Darn. Let's see what they say. Sorry, I'm spacing out, guys. It's hot out here. I'm trying to get shade. <clears throat> okay, here they come again. I don't know who they are. can't tell, it goes by so fast. Lunch, lunch. So, I think after this we're gonna eat lunch. Sounds good. We will find a place to go and eat lunch. And we'll eat lunch and then we'll go check out more sea animals, sea life. Uh, it is extremely hot out here. But, I got water, I have. This big bottle of water, and I have this backpack full of water. So we got plenty of water. Here comes another roller coaster. I don't know. I didn't see them on the last one. I don't know. I can't tell. They didn't look like they were on that one because I got to. I got a glimpse of who was in there. So I didn't see them. Maybe they were on the last one. Who knows? Sorry, guys. But I don't get. I personally don't get on roller coasters. How did you guys like the roller coaster? It was cool. <laughs> it was good. It was really good. But it felt like I'm gonna. They kept up. like tricking it's you, fun. like in there, you're like under. Looks like you're all in the water. There's like fish swimming around, uh -huh. and then it keeps going like this. Oh. <laughs> like, like you're gonna go, and then it's backs up, and then it's like you're gonna go, and then it backs up. Does that a lot of time, and then all of a sudden you just go really fast. You go really fast. Was the ride really fast? Uh -huh. I was like trying to look. Do you even hear me? No, I was trying to. No, I thought maybe it was you guys because I couldn't. It goes by so fast, I couldn't see you guys. Yeah, I was right. I saw you when I went over. Oh, oh. I know. I were you I waving? Huh? You guys yeah. were waving. Uh -huh. that, you were in the back seat, uh -huh. in the very, very back. No, the fifth. Oh, the fifth. I saw. I thought I saw you guys right there. I was like, oh. <laughs> you should see the picture of us. I'm like this. <laughs> I'm like, and Dre's like, and Dre's like smiling. You know? no, it's like cute. It. It's a cute picture. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it goes really super fast. I know. <laughs> see, and that's why you see that. I couldn't yeah, see you guys. It just drops. Yeah. I wanted to go back like and hold back so heads. it doesn't hurt my stomach. What'd you do? I just go. I was like this. <laughs> One guy, he 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 oh, had to get off. That's what took us so long. Why? Because he was too fat. Oh. <laughs> That's mean. Well, you can't That's go mean. on anyway, so. I don't get on no, those can't, can't, she can't get on because it said no back surgery, no back problems, or any kind of surgery, recent surgery on your back. Yep, no back surgery. I'm going to go back on that. And like I said, I had recent brain ride. surgery. Oh, yeah, that other ride, that, the first ride that we seen before we came in. That one. Oh, the Atlantis. Yeah, I want to go on that one. That one's so fun. I that think one this looks is Atlantis. Oh, this no, is this Manta. is the Manta. Atlantis is where we parked all the way that way. Oh, by do you have the? Do you you fit all that stuff? You left all that stuff in your pocket? No, just. I was map. looking for the map. Oh. <laughs> okay, I told. I said I figure we have it. <coughs> Three ways. We got the map. Let's go eat lunch first. Yeah. Yeah. All lunch. right, guys. I'm gonna sit on the ride. We're gonna go eat lunch. Hey. I'll go back to you guys as well. Hey, and we have flamingos. Look, there's a tiny, a whole bunch over there. It's a tiny one. Look, oh, Dan. I'm gonna drop it. Go over there. Look. Put the camera over there. There's a whole bunch of. I know. Why did they put their face underwater? Uh, they're eating. It's flamingos. They're like picking food. Look at that one right there. Yeah, that one, that one that's looking at us. This one's just eating. That one's just staying like. I'm I don't know. Look at all those flamingos. If you go over there, more over there, it stinks. Look, they're baby. They're baby flamingos. They have no color yet. Look at how they're walking. You see? Yeah. <laughs> those right there are just ducks. Ducks. <laughs> Look at all those. 
I know, they're fighting over there. And then we have those ones over there. I didn't take a picture of those over there. Look at the baby ones, they're like... I know, I took a picture of them. <laughs> Okay, let's get on. No more flamingos. I'm saying. Move over. Can, can you get? Come and get my cane. Can I honk please? two times, please? Come I and get my cane, and I'll let you honk. Where's um? Uh -huh, got it. Ah, thank you. Now can I honk? Yep. Wait, it's not on. It's not on. <laughs> Stop, Drake. <Dre. laughs> That's enough. I love honking now. When I'm older, I'm just gonna honk for fun. Hold on, because I'm gonna fall off. Huh? No, I'm gonna fall off because Dre. I'm, I'm I'm the one oh, I'm still recording. What the heck? He's going to feed. He just threw them all in there. <laughs> he didn't even feed them, he just threw them all in there. Anyways, this is fl about flamingo families. If you want to kill, go get it. Huh? See the baby ones, the baby, the baby flamingos. They're just gray and got that feathery, soft feathers. And then I guess they don't get their their pink color until later. Later. So, yeah. Okay. Now we're gonna look for the sharks and the turtles. Oh, yeah, they're fighting over there. What are they fighting over? <laughs> They're fighting. <laughs> Flamingo fight. Flamingo fight. What about those? The ones that have arrows. Do okay. Those are seals. Those yeah. are little baby Squid. squibs. Those, that's a sea urchin. And those are little planktons. Do, do they eat the ones? Uh huh. Sharks eat all of those. Dang, they don't eat anything else except those? Yep. Sharks eat other stuff too. Let go of the rail. Like over there. I don't really Picture have of a shark. Right now, we're going into the shark aquarium. Because I want to. Do what? Because I want to want to. Because I want to go in the sharks. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> He's so excited about sharks. Yes. I love sharks. <laughs> Here we go. I'm Ready? holding. Put your arm. Here, hold it. But don't drop it. Okay. There you go. You need. Wait, wait, wait. Dre, there's people. Okay. Look at all the people, people. I said, look at all the people, people. <laughs> mm-hmm. Here we go. Into the shark I was waiting for all those people. Damn, 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 damn. Damn, 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 They're rude. I ran over a guy already because he wasn't paying attention. I was right behind you when that Oh, happened. yeah. I said, excuse me. Go ahead. <laughs> no, go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. Yeah, now we're going in the shark pit. Down, down, down. Going in the shark pit. Oh, my God. This is Let's see this. Yeah, go ahead. Let's Don't grab my camera. I'm not. Let's see what this is. I'm done. I know there's more sharks. There's a whole bunch more. Watch. Let me close this so you don't drop it. Okay? Uh, ooh. There we go. Let's go. See the other sharks. Bye bye. And look. Maybe. Yeah. Say hi. Bune! Bune, say hi. 
Uh, look, there's jerks everywhere. Renee, say hi. Hi. Look at all these people. My grandma, Renee, me, Seth, and these people, and the big donut. Oh my gosh, I'm getting claustrophobic. 
I'm trying, but everyone's not watching where they're going, and they, they see me right here. Excuse me. Fuck, man. Ha, ha, ha.